scientists at Mosquito Control identified 23 more mosquito samples from around Sacramento County today, which tested positive for West Nile virus. The virus has been spreading through birds and mosquitoes for several weeks now, prompting mosquito control to begin aerial spraying on Monday. The goal and the objective of the aerial spraying is to reduce the abundance of those adult infected mosquito populations that we know are posing a threat. For Ilse Bizaron, who is already allergic to mosquitoes, one bite can spell trouble. When we go outside, like there is a lot of mosquitoes and we have to kind of be careful where, like what times we go out and stuff. She lives in the pocket neighborhood of Sacramento, where there has been a higher concentration of infected mosquitoes. Actually, I wouldn't go out at all. Like after the hours when there's more mosquitoes, I wouldn't go out at all. Mosquitoes thrive where there is a lot of stagnant water. The city kept canals in the pocket area from draining into the Sacramento River while applying a chemical to kill algae, leading the water to back into drainage where mosquitoes could breed. But mosquito control says that may just be one factor. For sure that's not solely responsible at all because we're seeing the same levels of West Lambert's activity in El Grove and there's no water issues there. And after trying for weeks to battle the spread of West Nile virus from the ground, mosquito control is now turning to the skies to spray from the air for the first time over an urban area in more than a year. In Sacramento, Kevin Oliver, KCRA 3 News.